Meanwhile, in Ondo State, Governor Rotimi Akiridolu says Wednesday's shooting at the yard of the Cranberg Construction Company in Owo was aimed at destroying some of the equipment and not to maim or kill anyone. Governor Akiridolu, who visited the construction site and company of heads of security agencies in the state, urged the people not to panic. TVC News, Ayodeji Moradio has more. Normalcy has returned to the ancient town of Awa in Undo State after the attack on Krimbog Construction Company. The attack left two persons injured as residents continue to visit the scene to assess the extent of damage. The people here are coming to witness to see for themselves what actually happened. We can't continue with, with this. And this is not acceptable. This is not acceptable. We must put an end to this. So we have to call on everybody. We have to come together to work together to put an end. And they throw dynamite in the other one of our pedal loader, this thing, and they spoil the tire. So people were, were running, scatter and scatter. So I run inside the toilet. Later we were helping shout help, help outside. The state governor, Rotimi Akedulu, also visited at the scene of the attack to see things for himself. Governor Akredolu allayed the people's fear, saying the attack was not an attempt to kidnap. The governor assured the people of provision of adequate security across the state. Clearly, what happened there yesterday night was not an attempt to kidnap anybody. Because they went away with nobody. And we have in these premises over 100 people live there. Whereas there are sporadic gunshots uh, to the wall, or they never went inside to kill anybody. It's better for, you, for everybody to know. The state police command has also reacted to the attack with an assurance that the attackers were brought to justice. Command as a whole, we are calling for calm that investigation has started concerning this issue. And we will get back to the public with our findings. We want to also urge our people to please, this is not the time for us to start peddling fake news. Please let us be calm. We will get back to you. The two injured victims are responding to treatment at the Federal Medical Center FMC Award. The assurances from the police and the state government will go a long way in putting the minds of residents at rest. I am Bijimura, TVC News Award.